And 108 billion naira is what the Imo state government will spend in the year 2020 fiscal year. Now, a revised budget, Christine Budget of Rehabilitation, Reconstruction and Recovery, has been signed into law by Governor Hope Uzudima to actualize his vision of shared prosperity for the people of Imo State. TVC News Prince Uba reports. The decision to revise the 2020 budget from 197 billion naira to 108 billion naira was informed by the fall in oil prices and its negative effect on the economy of the country due to the coronavirus. Giving assent to the fiscal document, Governor Hope Uzadima said the revised budget clearly outlines the government's political, economic and social development programs with policies and strategies aimed at placing the well-being of the citizens at the center of governance. This will be achieved through massive reconstruction of our dilapidated infrastructure improving the ease of doing business, ensuring sustainable economic development, as well as encapsulating our vision of a new Imo state, which is predicated on freedom, security, and shared prosperity, welded into good governance. The recurrent expenditure in the first budget was 91 billion naira, while the revised recurrent expenditure now stands at 63 billion naira, which represents a 30.7% reduction in the revised budget. The capital expenditure also saw a significant reduction of 41% from the initial budget. I'm proud to note that our government has not left any stone unturned in containing the prevalence of coronavirus pandemic. We've taken all necessary measures to curtail its spread in Imo State, in line with NCDC and WHO guidelines. Equally noteworthy is the laudable feat to achieve by producing the first ever Imo State citizens' budget in line with international debt practices. We are compelled by the prevailing circumstances to bring down a bit the budget of a 106 billion that was passed under the previous administration. So we thought this way because that budget is not uh, going to work out. So because uh, there's a global downtrend in the financial economy of the world, which heavily affected the most states, like any other country in the world, in other states. So we brought it back to the same of uh, one billion. To mitigate the impact of the coronavirus on the people, the Imo state government granted a number of tax reliefs, which include waivers on personal income tax, consumption tax, pay as you earn for private schools, and levies for tricycle and motorcycle operators. Prince Oba, TVC News, Oweri.